making some progress tonight. Um, let's see. To the monarch wilderness. I oughta kept me alive this long. I mean, you treat it nice. Makes me happy to see, cause I feel the same way about my wrench. Look, it's a tool that does a job. Feelings got nothing to do with it. Running past them. Okay, so we need to get all the way up there. Also, there's a town right here. Are they hostile, though? Yes, they are. Let's keep going this way. Ow. Uh-oh. Don't mind me. Just passing through. Oh, hey. I saw something to my right, but I don't know where it went. Things are big. So that's terrifying. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Adios. Take it. Get it! Hit it! Kill it with fire! Oh, that's dead. They won't try that again. Okay. Alright, nice. There's a pathway to our right. I'm on fire. Unfiltered air, rocks in my shoes, risky choke points, all the things I hate about mountains. We ought to camp out Me here, too. you know? Make a little fire, sing songs. Here we go! How about that? You got it, Captain! Hit it! Oh! Out of ammo. Out of ammo. Okay. Uh, let me check that weapon that I found. So is this 98, 318, 73, 122. What's this take heavy? Magazine size six, special effect execute. This has higher DPS, but this has higher damage. Post armor dealt. This one has the highest damage. Pair all equipped. That's all set there. I like these uh, special weapons we find. They're pretty cool. I have another pistol. This one's energy. Uh, this one, this gun's energy also. 
It's actually better. I guess the size. Swap that. You can try this. Get him. Oh man, that's a big guy. That's a big guy. Oh man. Armadi, heal yourself. I can't tell. That was a little bit sketchy. Just a little sketchy. Okay. Character skills. I'm so bummed that you can't bump this up. I would have rather bumped up this perception. It helps you with all your stuff too. Huh. All right, so it's at 80. I've 10. I might want to take some damage. Yeah, let's get these to 50. Because otherwise, it's kind of taking a little bit. 50% damage? Yeah, definitely. Okay. Kill it with fire. I think we're a little bit under leveled for damage hey, you, wise before this. I always wanted to poke through a high gain wire. Hello? This station's under the protection of the corporate compliance crew. You a marauder? Cause me and my sunshine, that's my gun if you were wondering. We don't Uh no. A coherent enough response, I reckon. Must be true. You're clear. But I would caution Very you trusting. against pressing on ahead. This station's plumb crawling with marauders, you know. Thanks for the tip. Hey, we're here to help. Long as the paperwork's done and the pa Me and Sunshine are doing exactly what we've been tasked with. And that's guarding these big old devil's peak. I'm off. <laughs> okay. Oh god, these are marauders. Oh wait! I didn't know. I thought they were... I'm about to die. I need heal. Uh on your left, on your left. Nice. It's not working.
Really? She just got shot in the head there. Okay, nice. Take that. Anyone else? Uh, I think they're good. Thank you for all that. Eternal anatomy. Anid examined. Oh man, looks like there's a good amount of them in here. You may not realize this being as you're an outsider, but the blaring alarms indicate the station's on. Nice. Not bad, huh? Down they go. Ah, I need a new pistol. It's like the Mandalorian right there. <laughs> Do we need to go upstairs? Um. Hmm. Do I want to break into that. I'll hold off for now, just in case if I need that. You out there, whoever you are, yes, yes, I can see you. Come here and talk to me. I can't tell if you're brave or simply touched in the head. What in the galaxy are you doing sniffing around my station? Unless you are, in fact, trying to suicide by Marauder? Uh... I'm looking for an information Not broker. Coherent. Good. Take it you're not with the Marauders, then. By the hand of fate and my own cunning skill, I run this station. The Marauders may have other plans. And since my hired hands have clearly turned idle, it appears I have need of you. As my newest contractor, you may call me the broker. Nice. Okay, broker. Excellent. I have a good feeling about our business relationship. I'm sure it will go much okay. more smoothly than with those broker. mercenaries I hired. I barricaded the broadcast center, but I can only hold out for so long. Clear the marauders out, and I'll pay you double the going rate. They destroy the transmission of the elevator. I trade in secrets. Valuable. See what I can do. Okay. Okay, nice. Surprise, we haven't ran out of like. Oh, here it is. Y'all kids ready? It's about to get hot. Here comes the... Uh, I don't know. I'm just here to do my job. I'm just here so I don't get fined. Time for a drink. How do you access your medical stuff? I keep forgetting. 
Also, there's a lot in here. I'm gonna see that says one. Trolls, keybinds. Taylor, TTD, companion move, attack, follow, weapon, next weapon, weapon style, character menu, companion menu, view map. I'm so confused. Outer worlds, use consume. This works when you press the heal button F it will use all these items on the hot bar at once. Oh really? Really? What? I didn't know that. Huh. Interesting. I thought it would just use your heal thing. And that's it. But okay. I love watching that. Sorry. Don't be sorry. Take your best shot. I love making them do all the work. That was the Marauder Ringleader. Just like that. Ah, uh, let me in. Bang. Never thought What's going I'd on here? I'm having the walls painted in blood. Ram. Seeing as it's not mine, I'd say this calls for a celebration. This ought to square our debt. One hefty payment for a highly valued service. Okay. All right. But all right. I admit, I do wonder why you ventured here at all. Allow me to pose my question in another manner. Why, in the nebula, are you here? I'm looking for a certain information broker. Ah, yes. Our little chat on the intercom. You're looking for the premier broker for all of Monarch, which you knew was me, clearly. Phineas must have sent you. He's the only one insane enough to send someone to Monarch to rush me. I knew it was only a matter of time before he came a-knocking. Look, I might be late, but I fulfill my contracts, always. Are you fibbing? Be honest. Careful, I know that line. I use it all the time. I take offense to that. Look, okay. Just, it might take me a while this time. Why is that? I am awaiting but a single incoming transmission containing the information we desire. But MSI and the Iconoclasts are clogging the airwaves from Stellar Bay and Amber Heights. In their war against each other, they're scrambling each other's outgoing transmissions. Oh, what a surprise. Do we kick them off? Exactly what I was thinking. They hurt us all with their pettiness. Which, of course, has inadvertently affected the incoming port and my livelihood. Can we cut them off inside the station? No, they're jamming the limited frequencies we have at our disposal. Nothing extra planetary can get in or out until the frequency pollution thins out. The safest bet is to convince Graham and Sanjar to stop transmitting on their end. Talk some sense into them. You do that, I'll be here waiting on the receiving end. Luck be- Sure. Okay. So, we need to go convince them. Oh, good. 
can leave out this way. Anta Swarm examinated. Examined. Oh my gosh. Can't. Words are hard. Difficult. Understand. Read. Uh, who should we go to first? Well, this person's closer, so we'll go there. Anti. Anthra. Didn't read it. <laughs> Better than nature. Okay. Who are you? Well, hello. I'm and you. welcome to the home of the iconoclast. You're me? I'm Rose. Please take a pamphlet. Oh, yeah. In it, you'll find everything you need to know about Graham, his philosophist truths, and the iconoclast way. He wrote it himself, you know. Did he? Oh, oh no, I'm so sorry. I keep forgetting. We're out of pamphlets. Gosh, blast it. <laughs> okay. Who are the Iron Class? Why, we're the only free people in Halcyon. No corporations, no shadows. Why I feel no like problems. this is some sort of Scientology nonsense? Uh, what about the Rapidons or Marauders? Oh, those are just hurdles. We deal with them as they come. You're welcome to stay with us so long as you can earn your keep. Yeah, I don't know about that. Got it. See you around. Seems like a nice little town. Except for all the dead critters. It ain't right. Mm. How many good folk are we gonna lose to our missions? That's just the way of it. A manta queen. Yeah. We felled it, mind. But uh, excuse me, sir. A stranger comes to our home. If you're looking for a path to walk, you've found one. If you're looking for a teacher, I am one. Welcome to the Iconoclasts. Iconoclast. What do you teach? Uh, I'm told you're out of pamphlets. The truth that I have come to learn and embrace since shedding the corporate yoke. Out here, we survive by the sheer strength of our spirit. We have no need for the endless rules and red tape of a corporate structure. We do seem to burn through endless ammunition and medical tape, though. <laughs> yes, well, such is life. Our descendants will enjoy safety and luxury, but our generation is the foundation on which that future is built. Now, why have you come? Well, uh, you see, Rem needs to stop using Devil's Peak. Stop? No. Spreading the truth is the only way to combat the board's poisonous campaign of propaganda against their people. Really think that the board's going to let its citizens listen to your propaganda? They can't be everywhere at once. Surely there are radios that still catch our message here and there. Surely... We're only transmitted on a single radio frequency and very few people can receive it. Uh, excuse me. I'm from Edgewater on Terra 2. If you'll pardon my saying, nobody I know has ever heard of you. All the more reason to double down on our efforts. Graham, we should be focusing on survival anyway. Food, ammo, and medicine. He's right. Maybe now's the time to pivot. Listen to Zora. Pivot, huh? If radio isn't working, we might try another way. It seems the captain's timing is more than just serendipitous. It must be fate. <laughs> I've had my sights on an old printing press for some time. The board uses magazines and advertisements to subtly focus the colony's attention. We will use their tricks against them. Wait, that's not what I meant. 
Help me clear out and repair the press, and I will have no need for that rust bucket of a radio tower. <sighs> That's too much work. I'll just kill you now and be done with it. <laughs> what am I saying? You want to print propaganda in their magazines? Might actually have better reach. People read that stuff all over the system, even in Byzantium. You see, citizens of Halcyon are glued to their periodicals. Even I find myself occasionally distracted by their positively shameful quality of editing and unacceptable disregard for grammatical structure. My literary prowess will hook them and the eternal truth will reel them in. <laughs> Listen to me. It's not I'm bad. starting to sound like one of Sanjar's fishermen. All right, I'll help. Wonderful. I requisitioned replacement rollers for it some time ago. Huxley should have delivered them yesterday. Speaking of which... You bought... rollers? You haven't even cleared the wraps out yet. Wait. It seems we're out a runner. If you intend to help our cause, I'll ask you to meet our MSI supplier in her stead. Fine. Alright, I'll be back. Wonderful. While you're at it, I wonder if Carlotta still has I'll those high-capacity cartridges? Grab a few, will you? There should be some funds left over from the last shipment. We can use them to copy and modify radio serials. Unbelievable. I hope I don't have to tell you this, but if there is extra money, would you mind buying, I don't know, Graham, if you need- <laughs> She's really upset. Get high capacity cart- colleges or extra supplies. That's optional though. Okay, maybe. Maybe we'll help them out with that too. Ah, crazy town. They seem nice, and I think it's better than better off than working for the board. So we'll go do this. It's like more daytime now. To be honest, I don't really like this planet. The city was kind of cool, but I've I've enjoyed Edgewater and um, the Groundbreaker a lot more. See if I can get by them. Oh, no. Get him. Get him. I got him. That's the last of them. Nice. So junk. Whoa, we have a lot of weapons here. Can you sort by Weight, value, damage rating. Whoa, what? Oh man. 576? 480? I need to equip some of these. By value. Value to weight. Sort by value. Actually, before we do that, let me make sure I have... Uh, damage rating. Okay. 576, jeez. And this is heavy ammo, right? Yep, that's heavy. So that'll go there. 320, that's heavy also. Uh, 480. This is energy. Oh, man. Yes. Oh, it's flamethrower, though. Uh, for now, we'll hold on to it. 233. Sure, I'll put that there. We'll put that there. 233. 215. That's light ammo. These are all heavy, heavy. This one's light. Sawed off shotgun. It does less damage than this. Okay, let's check Ellie's equipment. 200. 215. Because it's an energy weapon, I'll keep her with that. Officer Spine. 134. She might be better off with this. Power attack damage. Uh, the modifications are pretty good on it, though. She can hold on to it for now. 
71. Yeah, let me get rid of that pistol. 320. I think that's good for now. Let's, let's fender. Let's sell. Let's do by value. Actually, let's do by damage rating and then we'll sell the lesser stuff. One, one sixty five. Yeah. Don't want to sell that. Okay. I'm gonna buy some ammo. Energy, heavy, light. How much is it to buy all of these? 100? Uh, that's not bad at all. Alright, sweet. That's all set there. Save real quick. Save complete. Niles? Excuse me, but this area's off limits. We got a leaky generator. It ain't safe. That's my nice way of telling you to saw it off. Uh. What's going on here? We're fixing a leaky generator. What's it to you? Just to meet someone here, that's what. Right. Carlotta. Yeah, she's inside. We got first rights. Uh, how long? Why are you after her? You'd have to ask the boss. I just know she wants... I need to get inside. And I'm just gonna let you walk on it. I'm here to investigate reports of Manny Swarm infestation. You're here for Carlotta. I get it. I'll get her. You get paid. We all go home with a win. Hell, I ain't gonna pass up free bits. Make it painful. Nice. It's too quiet. Hello? The squad is Good gone. Luck. I've been cooped up in here. Who are you anyway? Cat, Graham sent me to collect supplies. Thank you, thank you. I can take a hint. Just taking all the supplies I can get. Nice. All right, what you got? I don't know how you got those goons to leave. Graham ordered rollers and what's-its, right? For a printing press? Here, take them. Like I said. I'm just gonna take everything you have. I just sounded to ban you from working with the icon. You'd have to ask press. him. All I know is that if I get caught, I'll get- Are you helping Graham? It's an enviable thing he's doing. Free people and all that. I can't live that way. I need my structure, but I respect the iconoclasts for doing law help them. I don't know. 
Maybe sublight can lend a hey, hand. Hey, what are what are? I should go. Yeah, what's going on, look, Dan? How you doing? Graham's got a bit or two left in his. What do you want to look? For some hot pet. Uh, Dora suggested food and medicine. I always took that woman for the sensible type. Good on. Give them all my regards. And. Don't go eat, getting eaten. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I guess I'll break this open. Eh. Wasn't great stuff, but... Amber Heights. In we go. You sure have seen a lot of the colony, huh, Dr. Fenhill? Ellie. And sure, but most of it looks the same from inside a ship. Sorry, Dr. Ellie. I'm, I'm Dr. Telling Ellie. You the Van Noys are fine. Bullshit, Graham. They don't just abandon orders, and they weren't at the ruins. Where in this sulfur sodden hellhole did you send them? They're on a very important. Ah, we'll continue this later. Welcome back, Captain. Got your rollers. Thank the Eternal that someone's got some sense in their head. Carlotta usually schedules the next drop during the meeting. When's she coming? She isn't. Sandra declared her stop sale on goods to the iconoclasts. I can't most say that. Unfortunate. <laughs> this cuts off one of our only two supply lines on Monarch. Sandra, our old friend, you're about to cross a dangerous line. About to? That idiot just declared war. I. We will deal with his subversion later. For now, we must redouble our efforts to spread the truth to the colony. I would fix up the print printing press then. The print. Oh no, Graham, you didn't. I've already sent a team ahead to scout the press. One of our best. Meet them there and find out if they've been successful. You sent the Van Noys there, didn't you? Oh, for fuck's sake, Graham! We needed them in the ruins. Our people died out there. I they went confused. willing to fight for our cause. We need reinforcements. We need new recruits. The Van Noys saw the printing facility with the same importance as I. You're lucky they don't have airlocks on Monarch, or someone would have helped you into one by now. I have the utmost confidence in their abilities. Friends, we must have faith that the men and women we recruit can handle the duties for which we recruit them. But the word has to be priority number one, otherwise, how can this movement grow? You could have sent them after backing up Zora, right? Yes, you're damn right he could have, but he's so obsessed with preaching that he's become blind to our actual problems. Look, just... If the Van Noys are still alive, get them out of there. With Sanjar pressing the issue like this, I have a feeling we'll need them. Do everything I can. Alright, so let's go save these people for them. Nice thing about traveling with the captain. We meet all sorts.